I just wish uh, they would spend as much time uh, on thinking about ways in which they could end these atrocities and stop killing people as they have in drawing up lists of people who they want to ban from visiting Russia. Um, I have no intention of visiting Russia anyway, but I, at the end of the day, they spent time drawing up this list, and you know maybe they should have spent the time deciding how they could withdraw and, and take this ill-fated, atrocious mission that's cost so many lives. Here we are talking about uh, a, a list that was put out that to me is more about show business and, and, and whatnot, when there are thousands of people who are losing their lives, innocent people who are losing their lives and other atrocities that are being committed. So that's what I care about. That's what I'll continue to speak about. The notion that I would speak as a mayor or Jim Watson in Ottawa or Premier Ford, who are all on that list, that we should speak in defense of democracy and in defense of, sovereign, in defense of sovereignty and in defense of human rights and in defense of, of people being able to live their lives without fear of being set upon, uh, I mean, we'll just keep doing that because that's what we do here. You know, that is the benefit of a free country, is you can stand up and have an opinion uh, on what is going on elsewhere, especially where atrocities are being, being committed against a sovereign nation and its people, many of whom have relatives and friends uh, who live right here in the city of Toronto.